What is up guys my name is Talha and you're watching Gadgets Sphere so this is the Poco X3 Pro which is right now running the MIUI EU 12.4 latest custom rom of MIUI which is the MIUI EU now let me just show you here you can see Xiaomi EU 12.5.4 and to be honest it is a stable rom and i have been testing it since around a week and one thing for sure that is the performance is very very nice but sometimes like after i have switched from pixel experience sometimes it feels a little slow like yeah it is not that fast but uh, compared to normal miui it is still very very fast and very fluid the fluidity is very good like you know in the normal stock poco launch you don't have this animation now here there is no broken animations it feels very fluid now let's talk about its benchmark i have also tried playing bgmi but right now i'm going to show you the benchmark of this so here you can see in history i have done the benchmark of 11 september and this is the benchmark really impressive you guys can see it is 781 and 2694 so you can compare it to even the you know the note 20 ultra and i think my phone is just like seven scores below the note 20 ultra which is really impressive and in multi-core it is 2694 so again it is better than the note 20 ultra in terms of multi-core score the Note 20 has 2628, this one is 2694. So really, in terms of performance, this is a beast of a room. But as you all know, it is MIUI after all, and that is the problem. Like, you know, when you scroll apps, it does feel a little bit laggy at times. While playing BGMI, I noticed that the FPS, even after enabling it to 90, like you guys can see, this is the 90 FPS patch. But even after enabling it, it was a little bit slow, a little bit sluggish. That's one problem. In terms of the security, everything works. Here is the fingerprint scanner. Let me just show you. Boom, there you go. It works very flawlessly without a problem. So yeah, in terms of security, fingerprint scanner works without a doubt. And it also, I don't know why, fires in infrared for uh, face scanning. I don't know why. It's not that secure anyways. So now let me just try double tap to wake. So just double tap wake swipe up boom so this is the face unlock right now you guys can see it is working absolutely fine so in terms of those things it is very good now you can see you have this normal from the right you get the iphone style view and here we have the data type of thing so this is a new thing i guess but overall it is a normal miui rom not the best in terms of gaming i found out to be i found it to be not the best and yeah the camera quality is also not good like let me just take an image boom and show it to you guys so this is it takes a bit of time and that's the image like it is sharp enough to be honest but still you know the normal uh, google camera is way better in terms of the front camera i'm not gonna show you my face right now <laughs> yeah just see this there you go so in terms of the normal camera as well it's not that good so overall what about uh, like what do i think of this room first of all if you are switching from the normal miui you should switch because this is way better than normal you know way smooth normal but if you already have the pixel room or like me i am right now installing the pixel room you know why because i want to switch back to pixel because you know what pixel is pixel <laughs> don't want to compete so that's what i'm doing right now so that that is one thing and yeah google feed is still a little bit of laggy right now like i'm recording this video in 30 fps so you will not get any idea but at times i feel like the google feel uh, feel you know google feed is lagging at times that's what i feel and you know what uh, i mean overall temperatures are very good in this room like if you want to play games in this room the temperatures are very very good awesome the animations look really nice and smooth and fluid you guys can see and app openings is also very smooth like let me just close the spotify boom it goes back right in there so that is the smoothness the level of smoothness you will get a speaker quality is no doubt no problems in terms of that here we have dual speakers one on the earpiece and one on the bottom everything without a doubt works very very well let me just try to play an ncs and show you guys how good the speaker quality is so ncs there you go uh, i'm gonna play an ncs because you know i don't want to get copyright anyways so let's just play this one oh, whoa 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 so google ad like google wants to get me copyright anyways so that's one thing 
बट या आई मीन ओवरऑल एम आई यू आई एम आई यू आई इट लुक्स रियली गुड एंड इट इज़ लाइक अ कम्प्लीट रोम वैन यू स्विच टू पिक्सल समाइम्स यू मिस सम फीचर्स बट द स्मूथनेस इन स्क्रोलिंग कॉमेंट्स इज नॉट देर लुक एट दिस इट स्विच इज बैक टू सिक्सटी हर्ड सो दैट इज़ वेरी डिसअपॉइंटिंग लाइक नॉर्मली इफ आई स्क्रोल इन सेटिंग यू विल सी इट इज़ वेरी स्मूथ बट इफ आई स्क्रोल हेयर यू कैन सी इट इज़ सिक्सटी हर्ड सो दैट इज़ वन थिंग Now I'm going to play this so the sound and see how well the speakers are. Let's improve this to hundred percent. There you go. Okay. Now, now I'm going to block one of these speakers. There you go. It's working from here. So yeah, as you guys can see, the speaker quality is absolutely incredible. No doubts in that. Speaker quality is very good. Cameras are just okay for camera. Obviously, G Cam is the best deal ever. Fingerprint scanner is very fast. Face unlock is very fast. Charging is very good. But overall, I just don't prefer this over the stock uh, stock room. I prefer this over the stock room, but not over the Pixel Experience Plus. No way at all. Like Pixel is Pixel. Don't. try to get my ui because if you will get my ui you will not get that level of smoothness that level of feel and yeah in terms of gaming let me just play one quick game here and i uh, pretty by the way i'm very bad in this game so let's see how well i can score okay 3 to 1 go pom 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 there you go so the, in this game i get a score of around 100 at times but normally there you go <laughs> it's 25 so that's how the gaming works and while switching back from gaming you can see i feel a little bit of lag and that is the problem it is mi ui after all no matter how much customizations you do it is mi ui it is going to lag that's the thing and that's pretty much it for today's video what do you think tell me in the comments below and that's pretty much it thanks for watching catch you in the next one peace out